Hey! Hey! You must answer a riddle before you're allowed to enter. <coughs> I don't hey everybody, it's Dipio. And Nelly. Welcome back to the wonderful world of Maze. Hello, Vladdy. Vladdy's here. Oh, Vladdy is here and he is so welcome to be here. Alright, <laughs> so we're down in the sewer. We gotta go do some exploring, but looks like we got a few options ahead wow, of us. Wow, there's like a ramp at each end. Yeah. Um, and so, at least this doorway here. Yeah. So we're going to go ahead and follow my advice and go up to the left. Go left first. First things first. Because Although since we've been playing this, you have been going right first a lot. I, I, I can't even explain it. I just yeah, You just go. I'm letting the, the feelings guide me. <laughs> oh, we're going to have to find a crank. Is there a game ever that you don't have to find a crank? I don't know that there is. I can't think of a game. Mm -mm. Not any game that involves any amount of puzzling, no. No. There's always a crank. Mm -hmm. Later there will be some platforms that we have to stand on in the right order or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> also a, <laughs> a staple. Like somewhere down the line just like, no man. Cranks are where it's at. <laughs> So you're going one end and then the other end and then we'll check and the side hallways. And then we'll hallways. check the hallways. Yeah, okay. I think that's probably the best way to go. Okay, and... It's too dark in here. <laughs> I can't see a thing. Perhaps if we turned around... Oh, don't be ridiculous. This is a perfectly nice place to stand. Well, I can't argue with that logic. Neither can I. <laughs> and this is probably what would have happened if on those gone, other coins. Yeah. <laughs> They're just literally going <laughs> to ignore us. So... Door to hook room. Oh... Doesn't work. Okay. Are those the um, the rings? The hook rooms? Are those gonna raise the rings? Uh, it sounds like it. Are the rings should. hooks? Like, <laughs> like I think that's called an eye hook. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So that make that would make some sense. Yeah. I don't know if that's correct, but. Um, All right. Oh. Wait a second. What does this say? Is this the no, front no. door? Come back. It says. You do the lobby. Bob McTavish. Honorary lobby? Honorary lobby. Like, it's not a real lobby? <laughs> well, the other lobby is upstairs or whatever. <laughs> okay, this is a new place. <laughs> Bob, you buffoon! Why is there a lobby here? And what happened to the decontamination room? Five Cordial question attack. marks! <laughs> I think it's like it's a two. It's like a new symbol altogether. <laughs> He's so mad he merged. I'm sorry. <laughs> Vladdy is so noisy. <laughs> yeah, it's just constant <laughs> squeaking. Hiya, Ted. Pretty sure I told you. Did a little rework here. Think this will be a real high traffic spot for the tour. Gonna be a real moneymaker. Bob. <laughs> Words fail me. Idiot. Cordaily. Cordaily. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it says. It does. Cordaily. <laughs> and stop it with the statues. Cordially, Ted. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. Oh. Paul's Pools and Pest Removal. The flyer for Paul's Pools and Pest Removal advertises big savings for orders within a 20 mile radius of the shop, along with a free extermination of one pest. <laughs> pest. <laughs> the cheapest pool in the flyer has been circled several times in red pen. Sophie, like, is digging the pool and a mosquito bites him and he swats it. That, that's, that's it. That's, that's, your, the one that's pest. your one pest. <laughs> Bob, I noticed this flyer and assumed this was your work, so I will remind you pools are not safe to hold chemical waste why did you order one stupid cordially ted <laughs> i'm never gonna get past cordaily and, and look he, there's two pictures of him here instead of one oh, of each of them this is funny i didn't know i'd be yelling so much in this game <laughs> <laughs> you took this not because you want to make coffee but that you heard that coffee machines grant you one wish <laughs> <laughs> and after much thought, you wished for coffee. It didn't come true. And look, it's bun. It's, it's a bun. -na 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 -na. <laughs> it's the sound of like a chainsaw makes bun. -na 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 -na. A brochure for a company whose main goal is to fill, fulfill. 
And fulfill Spellborn. Yes, <laughs> Fulfill all of your low to mid-level lobby needs. On the back, one design in particular is circled in red pen. The cheapest one. The company tagline reads, Waiting never felt so good. <laughs> Alright, what do we got in here? I'm starting to talk like... Vladi. Like Vladi. Restart nuclear reactor? Nuclear reactor, yikeronis. Reserve power mode active. Alright, there's gonna be something going on here. There's a map. With lots of scribble levels. Right. Bob, I've made this map so our staff can restart the bargain basement reactor you ordered without blowing us all to kingdom come. Do me a favor and don't come anywhere near it. Moron. Cordially, Ted. Ted! Ted! I solved your maze! It took <laughs> me a little while, but I got it in the end! Bob! <laughs> <laughs> Bob, how are you, the stupid? Did you get your doctorate out of a cereal box? Cordially, Ted. <laughs> <laughs> so much yelling. Uh, this is quite possibly the worst written book of guidelines in the history of time. None of the guidelines make sense, and the instructional drawings all consist of a stick person running away from a large fire. <laughs> this is... Wait, no, go back oh. to it. Nuclear malt malt down, malt down. prevention, peep Provencian. edition. <laughs> <laughs> okay, at least those are, are purposeful misspellings. <laughs> when you when you start to realize, like, no, they didn't do that. <laughs> no, that was, that was on purpose. purpose. That That's was on purpose. a horrible nuclear explosion in 120. 120. 20 what seconds? Minutes, years. Years. Decades. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, that's the freaking Bob statue. I was like, what is that? All right, more boxes. Oh, we'll be, oh, we'll okay. be back here later. To do the nuclear reactor maze. Oh my goodness, that was just too funny. Bob is an utter moron and Ted is an utter screaming maniac. Okay, so we came this way. Yep. All right, oh, so. Oh goodness. The next uh, blue light. Up here. Oh, zero, zero. Up the stairs. Up the rainbow. Red. Orange, yellow, Roy, green, G, blue, indigo, Roy G B, Roy G B. Really indigo either. <laughs> All right, so we're now on sub one. Sub one. We were on zero zero Ooh, at, to start. And we're out over the water. Oh, I wonder if the grotto's above here. This place is pretty for what this place is. Right. What Whoa. the frick? Stupid American garbage. Vladdy, what are you doing? What did Vladdy do? Vladdy, don't go messing stuff up, man. We're... <laughs> oh, I guess it's picking it up would be a good idea. Yes, it does help. An instruction manual for building your very own two-man <laughs> submarine. Since Bob and Ted opted for the opt budget model, the manual is 800 pages long and mapped out in a fashion that is similar to a Choose Your Own Adventure novel. <laughs> a Lockhart DF-48 discount two-man submarine assembly instructions. Build your new submarine in 1,357 easy-to-read steps. <laughs> a locked, locked toolbox. toolbox. Uh, we have a muffin, so... Probably I not. Oh, wow. A loading skid. You decided to pick this up because you like the direction of the grain in the wood and that it gives you splinters while holding it from every conceivable <laughs> angle. <laughs> okay. Oh, look it. We walked right past him. Oh. Oh, Vladdy closed the door. That's what that was. Oh. You stupid bear. <laughs> <laughs> Locked us in here. <sighs> Hiya, Ted. Since this is a highly sensitive area, I added a new security door. No need to thank me. Can't be too careful. Bob! Bob, you do realize that your new security door closes for no reason and locks people inside this very secure area? Stop being cheap and get a door that works! Moron! Cordially, Ted. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you might have to bring it down a notch just for your throat. <laughs> <laughs> Die doing this. There's your key. We got a small key. That'll be the toolbox, by the yes. way. Hiya, Ted. Just FYI, I brought the acetylene. Acetylene. I can never say that. <laughs> acetylene gas tank up to the farm for the annual staff barbecue. Completely corn free, of course. Ha <laughs> ha, Bob. <laughs> Bob, how many times have I told you that we can't have barbecues on the farm? Put it back. We're days behind schedule. And stop joyriding with the tractor, dummy. Cordially, Ted. 
<laughs> I missed the period the first time and read Tractor Dummy. Tractor Dummy. Stop joyriding with the tractor dummy. <laughs> oh my God. A tractor dummy has work to do. Water. Blood is favorite. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't like water. Water. Blood is favorite. Okay. Uh, just cheeseburger wrappers. Hey, Ted! I upgraded the lifting system so two people could use it at once. Our efficiency will nearly <laughs> double! Bob! <laughs> Bob, know that I do not say this lightly, but this may well be the absolute worst idea you've ever had. Idiot! Cordially, Ted. <laughs> Everyone ends with a slur. <laughs> Lots of jelly. Oh, maybe oh. this is. Is your key to this or the. It's a shame you don't have a small hands, as handling this key would be <laughs> much easier. It looks like a key for a toolbox lock, which could be useful if you can manage to find the fine motor skills needed to operate such a small instrument. <laughs> <laughs> Bob, for the last time, stop leaving your junk everywhere. I don't know why you even have a cello case. You don't even own a cello. Dummy. Cordially, Ted. So they have a tractor dummy. They have a cello Strange dummy. Sealed box. See, now I would use the key to open the box. Right. Slid it along the tape. That's what I do. Okay. Hey, you Ted. Need this box of knickknacks loaded. Be a pal and move it for me, would you? Bob! Bob, you sloth! I'm not your errand boy! Load it yourself! Quarterly, Ted. <laughs> he didn't call him an idiot or a dummy or anything. No. Sloth. I, I think he was on a bed, uh, better, better mood that day. Yeah. Alright, so let's go up. Unlock this toolbox, but not yet. Why? Created by Pete's Games and Carnival, the design of the loading crane <laughs> appears to be based <laughs> off a simple claw game, a fact which excited Bob to no end. Ted, conversely, wasn't too thrilled about it, but was stuck with it anyway after Bob forged his signature in the <laughs> approval form. <laughs> oh, Bob. Uh, wait. Yep, I saw it. Water pipe. Oh, oh it's in a the folio. folio. This magic water pipe grants you the power to transport water from one end of it to the other. <laughs> there will be no reason for you to do this at any point in this adventure, but you will continue to carry it anyway, just in case. Just in case. <laughs> like I said, this is totally a, a trope. Uh -huh. A trope roofing game. I love it. Alright, let's open this toolbox. There's a hammer. There we go. Oh, and a box cutter. So are we going to smash the cello case? I'm going to assume the cheapest box cutter commercially available. This brand holds the distinction of being the only one that is rendered completely <laughs> useless after one swipe. <laughs> <laughs> For some reason, you feel the urge to break something beautiful with this instead of doing the standard task of hammering a nail. You don't know why you think these things. Oh, you do not talk about Fight Club. <laughs> All right. Oh, I love this game. <laughs> this game is... This is great. I love laughing. No, maybe not. But we will want this. Why are you so much garbage, Fabergé. idiot? Daddy does not understand. <laughs> Read about the Fabergé. <laughs> Why you pick up so much garbage, idiot? <laughs> Uh, Bob got his hands on these extravagant artifacts because he knew a guy and bought them in bulk so he could get a slight discount. He kept them even after he learned that they didn't contain any chocolate. <laughs> so I'm going to say no, we're going to smash a Fabergé egg yes. with the hammer. You're going to set it on the table and smash That's, that. Because that is, that is more beautiful than the cello case. That is my guess. Ding -ding. And it came with a priceless lockpick. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, All right. so the priceless lockpick can be used. Easily the most expensive lockpick in the world, but you don't really care because you have no idea how modern economics works. Well, we're breaking open Fabergé eggs. Is there Ooh. like plutonium rods in this? Vladdy will say this, but he probably could crawl through that vent and unlock the door. Yeah, you're going to do that, Vlad. A uh, nuclear fuel rod. For reasons known only to you, you are holding a very radioactive <laughs> fuel rod in your hands, ignore, ignoring every known safety procedure for proper containment and storage imaginable. Oh my goodness. <sighs> We're so dumb, we gotta be Bob. In there? Oh, butzo boy. <laughs> He's crawling. <laughs> Stupid idiot, making Vladdy crawl through dumb thing. What is Vladdy supposed to do in here? Stupid! Ah, ah, stupid wires everywhere! 
Why is this stupid? Oh! Ah, ah, why is this stupid thing upside down? Makes no sense. How stupid are these idiots? <laughs> Maybe a Vladdy can. Oh, ah, Vladdy has to. Oh, can't do this stuff. Ah, ah, boy, I so many Hey, idiot! Did that work? Stop being stupid and say something. <coughs> Fine. Vladdy done anyway. Two more Lushy drugs. Stupid idiot. Could get nowhere without Vladdy. Vladdy has to do everything. So, now what? <laughs> Vladdy did not like any part of that experience. Also, a new path is open to you. Probably somewhere radioactive. <laughs> so, Vladdy is Ted. And we're Bob. Vladdy is Ted and we're Bob. <laughs> we're the idiot. <laughs> idiot. And he's the angry one. Stupid idiot. <laughs> Moron. <laughs> why, why these stupid things? What is stupid? <laughs> stupid, stupid, stupid. <laughs> oh, so funny. Uh, so, back right. down the other hallway. What? Oh, we got something there. No, we can't go back. That's what that is. Can't go back. Yeah, that's where we initially came in. Oh, oh, no, no going back home is what you're saying. Right. But this isn't the way to go, I don't think, is it? Uh, I don't know. Wasn't there a, a, a path that was opened up here? Might have been the other place. I don't remember. Okay, yeah, we need, no, we need the, the we wheel. Need the thing. Okay, yeah. so then. No, I'm pretty sure it's the other open door at the bottom of the hall. At the other end of the bottom hall. At the, whatever. Keep going. I'll show you what I'm talking about. <laughs> Okie dokie. The other blue light hallway, I think. The red and blue pipes maybe things like veins and yeah. arteries running yeah. through. Not that. Not that. What? You think it's that? It's like through the lobby. Yeah. Somewhere radioactive? Yeah, here. And there were boxes right there and now they're gone. Oh, okay. Try not to be an idiot in there. It would be very bad. Hang on, Let what are the colors here? here? In case you do something stupid. <laughs> <laughs> we have light blue, we have yellow, green. green. Uh, nothing That's there. Alright, and we got rocks and nothing. Power plant entry. Oh. Please wear protective gear. Nah. Yeah, we'll just carry it. I mean, we're already carrying it, so. Nothing to see here. Nothing to do. We are Homer Simpson in this scenario. Oh, this is your 120. Oh, like you, you gotta get through it. here. Yeah. Okay. We're in another maze. Eek. Wait, is that That's a circle. Anything else that we could have done here? Ah! Doesn't appear to be. Did we miss a turn somewhere else? It's very possible. <laughs> Seems like all we're, circles. We're gonna die. Yeah, yeah. It's okay, Vladdy will reset us somehow. Maybe Vladdy will like cut it off at the last second. In case you do something stupid, idiot. <laughs> Can we turn it off? Nope, we got 60 seconds. Um, back here? Nope, that's no. too dark. Alright, we're coming in. Right is the only way. We get up here. And we have two ways, but I swear they connect. Yeah, that's... Oh no. That one doesn't connect. But it's probably still wrong. <laughs> yeah, it's just a different dead end. Yep, it is. Glad he's gonna save us, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> or he'll just be happy to watch Hang on, us. Can you turn right there? Right here. Okay, this looks interesting. Yeah, this is new. That was the turn that we missed before. Oh, now we're missing more turns. Died. Well, you really blew it. You should probably try that again. 
Stupid. <laughs> That's the only way I can think. All right. Well, hello, Vladdy. All right. Let's see if we can remember this. Hit that button again before oh, you blow are you up. Say fuel rod installation procedure. Is it just literally gonna like bucket drop it in the water? That is literally what it's gonna do. Yep. This place is stupid. What is right? <laughs> okay, now we're gonna go back up, I think. Back out of here. And kick Vladdy in the face. Hey, you didn't stop that? <laughs> you could have pushed the button. Right, instead of making us zigzag our way back. My goodness. Okay, so now, throw the switch. Restarted the worst nuclear reactor in the world. Was it nine seconds left by the end? Didn't we have 19? Huh? Yeah. Oh, 19. Yeah. I just saw that. Yeah. Okay. Facility power status. Okay. So that was step one. That was step one. Now we need to go open that door. Do the rod or the hook or whatever. Yeah. No. No. This way? Yep. Okay. The one closer to the entrance, I think, was the one that we needed a handle for. I'm guessing once we're done with this one, we maybe can take the handle from it. Ah, true. Okay. There's nothing here. And it breaks off, right? Or at least what I can... What is this stupid thing? <laughs> this, this stupid thing. Oh, see, nope, see, can't. and he's a Teddy -E Bear. Teddy -E Bear? No, he's a Vlad -E Bear. I know, but I'm just saying he is Ted. <laughs> still got the English muffin. <laughs> is that all we have now? Oh, we got another oh, rock. rock. And what did it say? Existentially and unstable. I think it says. Yes, existentially <laughs> unstable rock. This rock has no idea whether it is a rock, a facsimile of a rock, an amalgamation of many rocks, or a non-rock. By picking it up, you have undone all its conclusions about the world up until this point. You have named it Wallace. <laughs> oh, I love Wallace. Oh, Wallace. All right. So we're supposed to put something there. Oh, here we go. Oh, Vladdy Vlad. Again with the crawling? Yeah, he's no shorter when he crawls than he is when he stands. <laughs> what is Vladdy doing here? Is this Vladdy's purpose? Crawling uh, and climbing through stupid uh, junk to get uh, more stupid junk? <laughs> uh, and for what? This stupid garbage? This is useless. No use. No purpose. Just more garbage. Garbage for idiots. Always. <laughs> Garbage. Oh, this garbage worth Vladdy's suffering, but I already know the answer. No, because it's garbage. <sighs> what stupid thing is next? <laughs> I wish Teddy Ruxman was actually Vladdy Ruxman. Oh, Vladdy's really starting Vladdy, to hate Ben. Vladdy is way cooler than Teddy. Due to a communication error, this particular control console was designed to be removable from its base. It was lost approximately 60 times during the facility's <laughs> existence. <laughs> oh, Vladdy, Vladdy, Vladdy. He needs a hug. Oh, we're raising a hook. 
So, this is what stupid thing does? Vladdy still think it garbage. <laughs> I think you did it was important. important. Probably. Probably. Look at that. There's bird crap everywhere. Bird crap all over the place here. Okay, so we did that. Can we have the... Oh, here it is. It fell off. Can we have the... What do you think you control? may have problem, idiot? You take too much garbage. Um... I didn't see it light no, up. Cannot. Okay. It used to be lost all the time. We finally gave it a home. <laughs> right, right. Stupid, stupid home. Oh, poor Vladdy. I just want to give him hugs. <laughs> what is this stupid hug you give me? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Up we go. Attach stupid wheel to stupid door. Let's see what we've got to get to make this one work. Yes. Alright. Why did you need electricity to be able to twist Turn the thing? I'm not a clue. Okay. Well, this one's already got a button, but you know we're gonna look around. Yep. Uh-oh. Oh. What is that contraption? I don't know. Vladdy, come check this out. Oh. Step a stool. stool to get up to the to ladder. ladder. Okay. Is it going to open up and there'll be a stool in there? Is that going to be all there is to it? Alright, raise the hook. So that what? That makes four hooks up now? Four? Haven't oh, we seen two already? Good. Whoa! Uh oh. I mean three. you Vesilo. Why is this place so stupid? Nothing works. Idiot American machines. <laughs> <laughs> well done, idiot. Breaking it will help. Stupid. <laughs> you should take that dumb PC if you can fix it. <laughs> Breaking everything won't help you progress, in case that wasn't clear. <laughs> a broken gear half. You need to figure out a way to repair this broken gear if you want to raise that giant hook to the sky. The fact that you know nothing about engineering, mechanical repairs, or finding things means this will probably go very smoothly. <laughs> All right. And I missed the message that it says something about the grotto. Oh. Oh, oh wow. I see. It, once we get it, once you get it fixed. All right, we got a half of one here. No, so we, get a whole one we gotta go back to the grotto, it was saying? That is something, and the, but then the, you brought up the other thing and then it was gone by ah, the time. Okay. Um, well, I mean, the only way to do that is to go back and see if that door unlocked, because they locked us out of it. Right, but it said a path has been opened to you, so I'm thinking that they removed the boxes to let us back in. Okay. Yep. Oh, they blocked us off with more boxes, too. Yeah. All right. They're trying to make it easy on us. Like, look, this is the way you have to. I, I thought that someone was there. Make it <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Why are you so stupid? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I love this game. <laughs> oh my goodness. I needed this laughing, man. I tell you what. Okay. This is a really good way to end the day, just for those of you who are looking for, like, therapeutic. Oh my gosh. This is, this is a great way to end the day. Stupid way to end the day. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what are we uh, looking Where for? was the grotto? Is this the grotto? This looks like the garbage grotto. everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> but then I don't know what we need to do once we're down here. I have no um, idea. Well, what? This is to the <clears throat> bathroom, right? Or at least one of them was. To the offices. Is this place where all the garbage come from? What was that paper on the floor? Was there something lit up? Yeah, turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Which way around? Here. Up there by the cups. Oh. An invoice from a very famous painter commissioned to create a set of portraits of the founders. It appears to be spearheaded completely by Bob with very specific instructions on the style of portrait to be painted. Cost is in the millions. <laughs> I love these. I love these invoices, man. <laughs> oh, good eye. I missed that last time. Okay. So this this is the grotto. But I'm like I said, I missed the instructions. Is there any way to like see it in our in our um, notes and stuff? Um, I like I know we can read about all the junk we've picked up. Mm, I don't believe so. Okay. Folio so, items is all we have. I think so. 
But. Oh. Son. Cheeseburger wrapper. Oh. Originated from a local fast food restaurant. The nutrition information on the wrapper proudly proclaims now 100% salmonella free. There are, no exaggeration, thousands of these wrappers littering the facility, but a very fetching mustard stain on this particular one sparked you to pick it up. It's from Paulie's. Paulie's Burger and Grill. <laughs> oh my goodness. Now guaranteed salmonella free. Have we been down here? Um. No, I don't think we have. Was this was this? Uh, this was locked. Boxed. This is one of those doors. Oh yeah. This is one of those doors. Okay. All right, so that's probably where we need Path to go. Path open. Yeah, I think that's where we need to go, and I think that's where we need to stop. To stop, except we can't stop. We'll go ahead and we'll go through because. Uh, oh, because we haven't triggered anything. We got at least. Oh. These doors. Well, man. there's a trigger. Uh oh, Vladdy. Oh, magic. What you worried about? Vladdy can teleport. <laughs> yeah. No, he found one of those little grates and came through. No stupid door can stop Vladdy. Okay. What is this nonsense? Soda cans everywhere. Tin, Tin company. company. <laughs> All right. Tin soda. I told you where he is from. Vladdy is from small box. Very dark and stupid idiot brought him out of box and it was sad. Now we are here. <laughs> oh, I told you he needs a hug. It says something. These weirdo signs. Lobby. Another honorary, honorary lobby. lobby. There's a lot of lobbies in this place. Okay. What is this? A completely lazy oh, mystery one? novel. After an unexpected hit, the maligned author was forced to write a sequel. This time, he saved everyone the trouble of reading the book altogether and revealed the killer on the back flap. The novel actually chronicles the detective's struggle to return a pair of defective pants. <laughs> Night danger too. Danger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Let us read one more lovely note from Ted, and then I think we're going to call it a night. I think picking that up probably triggered the... I don't know. If it did, great. If it didn't, eh, we'll figure it out. Bob, I don't care how good a deal you got. No more lobbies! Idiot! Well, idiot. Cordially, Ted. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. So we have power. Thanks to thanks to Vladi and thanks to me and thanks to Nelly. We are all geared up. Well, uh -huh, we're, we're, half, we're, geared we're up. half geared up <laughs> and ready to run. Okay. So we'll pick it up here next time and uh, see what else is going on. I want to keep playing, to be honest. <laughs> but you guys don't want to, you know, a straight <laughs> two hour run for us again. Yeah. So. <laughs> no. We'll All right, it. we'll cut it now, but we will come back because this is this is good. This, this is, is good. <laughs> All right, guys, take care of yourselves. Bye bye.